Corner Snap Reviews. In this episode, we are reviewing some fun stuff for this year. What's coming out this summer? The Minion Movie. So what does that mean? Minion Merchandise. Yes, we had the awesome Minion Mega Blocks, but that's not all that we picked up. Hey, banana. So yes, we have different Minion products. And because we have different Minion products, we're going to do a little Minion episode here. Like this right here. I can't do much with this, unfortunately. I have a Samsung Galaxy, not an iPhone. But if you have an iPhone, you can get a Minion iPhone case. Yes, lots of little Minions. Lots of them. Just running all around, making goofy faces, all sorts of goodness. Um, I've never had an iPhone in my life, so they don't make the cool cases for my phones. I've always had droids, and the best I usually get is my awesome otter case, so I go with that. But this here, I do not know what I have. It is a Despicable Me 2 Surprise Minion Inside. Yes, it is a Surprise Minion Pack. So it could either have the Minions, but they also have, well, some of the human characters. I'd rather have a Minion, but this is time to find out what did I get in this Surprise Pack. I got a Minion! Yay! I got a Minion with Minion Cupcake! Yes! And it's a very happy Minion. This is Minion with Cupcake! Ha ha! They don't even bother naming you. Well, you kind of remind me of... I think Stuart had one eye. So you're Bob, right? You're Bob. So I had a Bob here. He's my new minion with a cupcake. Yes, he has a cupcake. And I like that it is actually a minion cupcake. It's not just a minion holding a cupcake. It's a minion with a minion cupcake. And I knew what it was before I read that. So I actually think that's kind of funny. And uh, he's very happy with his little cupcake. But of course, then we have our giant minion here, which is the last of the minion items in this little batch that I got. And this one, again, Despicable Me 2 product. Not actually, you know, the minion movie. But it's still a minion, and it's a nice little plush minion. What I like with it is that the little goggle around the eyes, it's not hard, hard. The eye itself is hard, so it kind of feels hard, but it's rubber, while everything else is soft, kind of bouncy and, you know, tossable. You can throw it around and, yeah, just kind of have fun with that. <laughs> so... I like Minions. I love the Despicable Me movies. Uh, minions are always awesome. I would love my own army of Minions. I think Shredder would love his own army of Minions because they could get a lot done for him. And they like being evil. So we got to see the, the new Minion movie and find out just what little things these Minions get themselves into as we learn the history before Gru. Can't wait for the movie. Loving the products. I, this little guy is kind of cute. So now I have a minion that can hang out with the minion. And they could probably hang out with my Mega Block minion too. So I'm getting a minion collection. Yes. The world will be mine. A little unknown fact about me is that when I went to see the very first Despicable Me movie, I actually had a minion with me. That's right. My sister made a minion. And it was about this big. And when I went to the movie, it sat in the seat next to me at the theater. And at first, people were giving us a weird looks like, what in the world? Where did you get that? And then after the movie, they were all like, we want one! But this was the only little minion that my sister actually made like that. So I enjoyed having my own little minion at the movie theater opening night of the first Despicable Me movie. That's how much I love minions, and that's how much I'm enjoying the new stuff coming out about the Minions. I've also won my own Minions out of claw machines and other things. So yes, I am a fan of the Mighty Minions. Banana! 
We will catch you here next time on Cowabunga Corner with a lot more reviews of new stuff coming out. Turtles, non-turtles, just about anything we can get our hands on that looks fun, exciting. It could be a toy, it could be a comic, it could be a movie. You never know until you check out the website to see what we got. Uh, remember to check out the description for anything else I might add, like the people who made the products, stuff like that. All credits and stuff will definitely try to be addressed in our description, which is on www.cowabungacorner.com. Check us out there. Cowabunga! Keep your feet